Hot dip galvanizing is achieved by immersing clean steel products in molten zinc at 830 to 850 degrees Fahrenheit. But before the steel can enter the galvanizing kettle, it must go through a four-step cleaning process. The steel first enters the caustic tank at 180 degrees Fahrenheit in order to remove paint residue. It's then rinsed in a fresh water tank at ambient temperature. Next, it enters the pickling tank of heated sulfuric acid at 140 to 145 degrees Fahrenheit where all mill scale is removed. The final step before entering the kettle is the flux tank, which is a mixture of zinc chloride and ammonium chloride at 140 to 170 degrees Fahrenheit. Proper fluxing provides oxidation protection before galvanizing. After the steel has been properly cleaned, it is now ready to enter the galvanizing kettle. The kettle contains molten zinc that is heated between 830 and 850 degrees Fahrenheit. When the steel comes in contact with the molten zinc, a diffusion reaction takes place, forming a new metallurgical bonded zinc iron alloy layer. Before the steel exits the molten zinc, residue must be skimmed back to ensure that the material can exit through pure zinc. Immediately following the kettle, the steel is quenched in a tank of aqueous sodium dichromate at ambient temperature to help bring the temperature down before post-galvanizing cleaning. This process also enables the zinc coating to remain brighter for a longer period of time. During post-galvanizing cleaning, any drips, marks, excess zinc, or surface dirt is removed. A millage test takes place out in the yard on poles to ensure proper coating thickness as per ASTM 123 specification before it can be shipped to the customer.